Hi everyone, thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Today we are doing a plan with me. We are going to work on um, the weeks of October 29th and the week of November 5th. Um, I will be sure to check out the description below. I will try to link the shops that I use stickers from. I will also have any referral codes or discounts down there as well as links to my social media. I do have $10 off your first purchase of Erin Condren. If you use that referral link down there, it gives me $10 back, but it also gives you $10 off your first purchase. So we will get right into it. I had some of these stickers from another kit that I had, and I wanted to use those to finish up October. And then after that, I'm gonna pull in these stickers to be kind of the November for this week. Um, these are from Danny Faith Designs, and um, these I want to say are from So Cute Planner. Um, I'll have to double check and I'll try to link it below. So we will get these laid out really quick, and then um, I will come back and we will kind of lay out the rest of the week. Okay, so I laid those out how I wanted these. These were from a monthly view, so they've got some little space there. I might put some washi there or I might leave it as is. It really doesn't bother me that much. So we've got those and then we start our fall ones here. And so I just laid out some of the full boxes that I really wanted to use. And then um, I think um, I'm just going to kind of lay out my chores. Move some stuff out of the way. Um, again, I'm kind of a mess with my kits. I blended kits and now I'm not sure what's what. So anyways, um, so we are going to do our water trackers. I don't think I'm going to do the morning and night routine like I have been doing. Um, it hasn't been very consistent. You know, completely my fault, but it hasn't been very consistent. So I'm not going to worry about that this week. Um, but I do want to keep focusing on tracking my water. And like I said, I'll probably, or like I said previously, I will probably continue to use this sheet until I run out. And then hopefully I will be in a good enough habit of tracking my water that I won't need habit trackers every day. If I do, um, I do have some dashboards. I might use those to track my water just to kind of save a little bit of money. And then let me flip this over here. And we are going to continue our no spin because we are saving for Christmas shopping on Black Friday. So the no spin will continue. And I'm just going to put that down here. And we are almost through this. I figure I can use the little broke and oh no and uh oh um, stickers anytime I slip up. Put those on the day to kind of keep track of that. And then... Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I wanted to pull in. I do have this, but I don't think those colors will go. And I do have this sheet, which the colors I think will work. So let's see. I try to pull some functional sheets that I can use um, and mix in with different ones. I think Actually, this has not been cut, so we're not going to use that. Okay, so I do have this page here from Tearful Planner Girl, and I think I'm going to pull some checks bo check boxes from it to use. I think it will go well with this kit, and that way I feel like I don't have it so plain. Now, I know on Halloween, I'm not sure how much we will try to get done. Let's see, let's lay this box down here. I think I'm actually going to pull this over. I know we will have plans to go out trick-or-treating on Halloween so I'm just gonna put that there for kind of things to do during the day and then I'll put this right here so 
So that gives me some checklists to use um, just to have. We'll put that back for right now. And then um, over here on this other side, we are, I'm not going to lay down any checklist. I think I'm going to leave it kind of blank. I do need to find my chore stickers to lay out. So, you know, we've got the litter box that needs to be cleaned. I'm going to do my nap time tracker that I've been doing. And then I will also put my dishwasher stick there, sticker down. Okay, so I found those. So we're going to put down our little nap tracker. And I think since I have enough room, I'll do a bigger one this time since I'm slowly using up my small ones. Or actually rather quickly using up my small ones. So we'll do a larger one this week. And then we will go ahead and we will plan, plan planning time on um, Saturday since I think at this point we don't have any plans that Saturday, subject to change. And then we will throw in our laundry sticker here. And I will probably try to focus on that on Friday. And then I guess my dishwashing stickers have been completely misplaced. So when I find those, oh, here we go. Now that I found those, uh, I will throw one of those in down here. And I did pull some fall bucket list ones, but I'm not sure any of these apply to this week. Actually, you know what? A couple do, or at least one does. So we've got our trick or treat one here. We'll put that down. And I might actually move my checkbox. So this will be things I need to get done before we go trick-or-treating in this checkbox and then we'll put our trick-or-treat box down afterward. Okay, so this will be kind of things to get done during the day before we go trick-or-treating, and then we'll go trick-or-treating that night. Um, trying to think if I need any of these. And at the moment, I don't think I do. So this is all I'm going to do for now. I'm sure I will add little things in as they come to me, but kept it very simple this week. Um, and we'll see how this planning goes for me. And then let's go on and we'll get into the next week. So for the next week, I am going to use, which kit did I want to use? I pulled a few different ones. Okay, so for the next week, I wanted to use this page um, from Sweet Bean Plans. It was a full kit, but I just purchased the full boxes because I was in love with them. And I figured these blues would go great with the blue that um, Erin Condren used for November. So I will lay these out. I think we're going to do things a little bit differently because I want to keep these boxes together. So we'll see how this goes. Okay, so I am getting the rest of this laid out. Um, I do have one blank box here. But I figured I would leave that blank because we often end up with plans on a Saturday and I didn't want to fill that in and want to put a box there. So I do got that put down. Um, I'm not going to put anything there yet though. I do have these if I want to use those. And I think I'm actually going to use these checklists on the other side for my weekdays here. So um, again, just kind of playing off the blues. This week, I, I wanted to go with a different color scheme than what we've been doing. I absolutely love fall, but I'm not a huge fan of orange. So throwing in some different colors kind of helps me to enjoy it a little bit. I mean, fall, the weather is perfect for me, but 
definitely like um, other colors a little bit more than the fall colors. Don't get me wrong though, the leaves changing here is absolutely stunning. I just don't want to see it every day in my planner. Um, and then we are going to just do our regular um, chores over here. And um, we are still continuing with the no spend. As soon as I can find that sheet, I'll lay one of those down. Um, but we'll go ahead and we will get my laundry sticker put down and we will probably focus on laundry on Fridays like I tried to do. And then again, planning time will probably be on Sundays, um, just because I never know what Saturdays are going to consist of. And um, let's see, none of those apply. Oh, here's my no spend. So I think what we're going to do, since I used so much of this up, is I will do my no spend over here. And I will do my nap tracker and I will actually do the dishwasher on Saturday and if it doesn't fall on Saturday that's fine. So we'll do our nap tracker and we'll do dishwasher. Generally it is done on Saturday mornings so we'll put that down and um, I think that's all I'm gonna lay out for this week. So um, I did run out of the litter box stickers so I don't have those right now to put down, but I'll put one down when I get more. So here is my layout, and I really love these colors, and they're not typical fall, but they're very pretty, and the jewel tones are probably one of my favorites. I really like this little caffeine queen down here, uh, words cannot espresso. And then we've got how much I love coffee. So that is my layout for that week, and thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.